Governor Tim Walz is sending signals that he could extend COVID closures of bars, restaurants, health clubs, and other venues past December 18th when his current shutdown order expires. I just think I have to be as candid with Minnesotans as possible. Our hospitals are at the highest capacity they've been. Our death rates for the last week was as high as any week in this pandemic. And our case positivity rate is the highest it's been. Uh, House uh, GOP Minority Leader Kurt Dowd says his advice to the governor. Let's try to figure out how to get businesses open safely. Let's not let's not try to figure out how to get businesses closed. Uh, Dowd argues businesses will need less state aid to get uh, through COVID if they can actually conduct some business on their own. Governor Wall said he doesn't want to play coy with folks because it's likely the state is not out of the worst of the COVID surge. And people have legitimate qualms saying, okay, you shut down a restaurant, but you're leaving big box stores open. Uh, The Walmarts, Best Buys, Targets, uh, it doesn't seem to make a whole lot of sense. Uh, But anyway, it's uh, looking like state lawmakers, if they pass a relief package for restaurants and bars closed by COVID, uh, probably won't do it until mid-December when they're back in St. Paul anyway to vote on the governor's emergency powers. Governor Walls insists there's uh, every reasonable opportunity to get it done in the next week or so. I'm not getting any, uh, what I feel is, is pushback around the desire for us to do a package and get it done as quickly as possible. And I think the sooner rather than later... And House Republican Minority Leader Kurt Dowd again wants any legislation to also relax COVID closures of health clubs and movie theaters, but adds... I'm not about to put an ultimatum on the governor to say, you know, we won't give businesses relief or give money to extend unemployment benefits or whatever unless you open up health clubs and and movie theaters. Uh, Senate Republicans, uh, key players in any deal, have not yet weighed in publicly. So stay tuned.